In this section, we're going to learn about the Pi Module Database and its impact on the client tools. We're going to describe the Module Database structure to you and talk about how it integrates into our client tools such as Process Book, Data Link, and in a later section, Web Parts. So what is this Pi Module Database? Well, the Pi Module Database is a hierarchical database that is contained on every Pi server and it's used to organize information and the key word here is in blue its context the Pi servers uh, as they are today before you uh, configure the module database and before the module database was introduced are essentially a uh, collection of unrelated points let's say for example I've got a device and I'm measuring 20 different points or, or aspects of that device and I want to see what tags I'm monitoring on that, on that specific device. Well, without the module database, you somehow have to have a list, an independent list of those tags, and you have to find a way to look those up on your server and such and so forth. With the Pi module database, I can build a hierarchy of my uh, facility or property or um, um, plant and I can build a hierarchy that includes that device. I can then set up aliases against that device and once I do that all of my users can simply drill down with the click of a mouse and find out what I'm monitoring on that device and select which tags they would like in their displays or spreadsheets. So what the module database does is it gives uh, a context to your uh, either facility or structure or process any any you can build it out any way you want here's a module database that's built out in what we refer to as a physical model where we have a corporation and they're building out their model based on division department and individual locations and they build out each location with the units and equipment and so um, there might be a tag, let's say, on this uh, uh, heat exchanger. There might be a, a, a feed effluent module. And those tags may have a certain naming convention that might only be known to people in that specific production area. However, with this module database structure, anybody in the corporation can drill down and see what pieces of equipment we're monitoring in Pi and what eventually uh, drilling down to the specific tag level. Now you can build this out in any structure you want. You can use your organizational structure. You can build it out by process. You can build it out by location. You can build it out by product line. The module database structure is completely independent of anything else. You build it out in, what, in the way that is most conducive to you and then you uh, tie tags and pro aliases and properties to each of these modules. And we're going to show you the effect of that in a few moments.